This was the small town of Aranda de Duero, a couple of hours north of Madrid today. These scenes were repeated in many other rural areas of the country. Spain's farmers have similar grievances to their counterparts in France, Belgium, Italy and other countries who have been protesting recently. They say that sanitary and environmental regulations imposed by the EU are too strict, drowning them in red tape and pushing up their costs. When it comes to producing, wheat and barley are very high. You've got to pay for fertilizer, pesticides, fuel. It's killing us. We have to pay very high prices and yet we sell at low prices. We have to undergo a lot of controls, a lot of regulations, says this farmer. And products from non-EU countries are not subjected to those same controls. EU regulations and rising costs are not the only grievances of Spanish farmers. They've long complained that the country's vast and sparsely populated rural heartland has been ignored and underfunded by the country's politicians. Many areas of the country are suffering a drought which is stunting harvests. Farmers see the climate as yet another obstacle. In Spain we don't have the same climate as the rest of Europe. With so much of Spain being desert, we shouldn't have to follow the same rules as other countries. The protests are expected to continue over the coming weeks, with farmers planning to drive their tractors into Madrid later this month. Guy Hedgeco, BBC News, Aranda de Duero.